This is TJ with Bull Ridge Plumbing. We're at 3507 Grove Drive, making a, doing a whole house colonoscopy. We're gonna be doctors today. It was always my dream growing up. Okay, maybe not, but still. Um, currently 80 feet out in the sewer, and I am hitting a separated joint right here in the clay waistline. Anytime we do a, or anytime we, we see a clay line, we expect to see separations and minor roots. This one doesn't disappoint. It's just that this separation is a little bit bigger and is a place of concern. You can see how the water is building right there. The savior is we've got enough gravity hitting it right now that I believe it's pushing it right, pushing any solids over the edge. But there's always that concern that one of these days it may catch. Um, we will take this back. We'll view it on the big screen and we'll get a couple different opinions from some of the other guys. And then everything will be on the final report. We're going to start backing up now. Once again, clay waistline, you can see that everything's draining in the lower third. Seems to be doing pretty well. Um, I couldn't see a lot coming down in because I was in water. So we were flushing the toilet to help it go down. Right here we have a slight separation. It is on the downhill side, so it's water falling over that joint. Cruising on back, looking pretty good here. Right there, we got another slight separation, a few roots coming in on that left top corner. Really, really minimal, not causing any issues. More roots coming in right here on this right side. Uh, slight belly right here in the sewer. Um, maybe three quarters of an inch deep. Anytime we have a belly like this, it's a concern because it may catch and hold debris, but really not a deep belly right here kind of tough to see right now because we're underwater and if you need to turn it you can lift it up so you can see what's going on here right here we got some roots coming down on that right side another slight separation um, because of the roots I'm going to recommend a rudex treatment rudex is a foaming root killer Fills the line completely, kills all those roots for up to a year. Okay. Um, right here we got another belly. Once again, always a risk of it catching and holding debris and sludge. And mm -hmm. Scared me. That's shame. <laughs> right here we got some roots coming in on the high side of the on the left there. Okay. Not a major issue at all. Yeah. A few more roots there on the top left. There's some roots right here that are running down from this joint up here. Okay. Starting to get down in the flow line. And then we should be jumping into the cast iron right here. Okay. Cast iron actually looks pretty good. We're going to pop out here. Here's where we accessed down here in the laundry room. We're going to recommend that Rudex treatment and then we'll take this back and we'll review it on the big screen. Okay. Awesome. This has been Bull Ridge Dirty Movie Production. Thank you.